At just 20, Sally Field, Hollywood's resilient gem, has faced more challenges and tragedies than many do in a lifetime. In her recent memoir, In Pieces, she unveiled a long-guarded secret about her relationship with Burt Reynolds, a revelation that has horrified fans. Her memoir reveals the reality behind the fame, exposing the turbulence beneath. The revelation about her connection with Reynolds stands out, but does it cut deeper than presumed? This isn't the only revelation. Field also candidly shared personal battles, shedding light on her dark and stormy journey. Brace yourself for a narrative that redefines her story, layer by layer, beneath the spotlight. Sally's Horrible Childhood There's no doubt Sally's recent revelation about her stormy romance with Burt Reynolds is quite the controversy. However, her difficult upbringing was a sadly traumatic encounter that unfolded outside of the public's knowledge. Born in 1946, Sally Margaret Field grew up in Pasadena, California, as the daughter of actress Margaret Field and salesman Richard Dryden Field. Her parents divorced in 1950, when Sally was only four years old, uprooting the family dynamic and leaving her father a remote figure in her life. The following year, Margaret married stuntman and actor Jock Mahoney, known by the nickname Jocko, becoming Sally's stepfather. Initially charming and doting, Jocko soon revealed a darker side by taking a twisted interest in his adolescent stepdaughter. Jocko's inappropriate behavior started with a special game, asking Sally to walk across his naked body. She recalled how she would try to keep her feet on his stomach area. However, he would whisper, asking her to go lower. At just 13, he also asked her to dance in a suggestive manner. The encounters pushed boundaries further over time, leaving Sally confused but unable to voice her discomfort to others. The abuse by her stepfather cast a shadow over Sally's psyche, manifesting in poor school performance as she coped through disassociation and retreating inward. Though Jocko never forced intercourse on Sally, his violations robbed her of security planting seeds of shame and secrecy. With no protector in sight, Sally endured the abuse silently while finding a faint silver lining in the coveted attention. Margaret, her mother, turned a blind eye to warning signs, neither safeguarding her daughter nor providing nurture during this formative period. Sally was left isolated in her trauma, forging an identity out of the fractured pieces of her childhood experiences while Sally found minor refuge in school plays, her home life only